We observe a moment of silence for the Nebuchadnezzar Saad and Tommy Keynes. A moment of silence where thousands of words of support for the families of the teenage victims of a fatal car crash in Fond du Lac County over the weekend. Just showing the families that we support them and want them to know that we love them and care for them and are hurting with, along with them. Amy Marks says her son played hockey with one of the victims, Tommy Koenigs. The hotel stays and fun in the pool and just in the hallways playing shinny hockey and just all of those times. And Tuesday night, the Fond du Lac High School Hockey Booster Club set up a donation box and tribute table for Koenig's family. I think we're all devastated, you know, that this happened and we're just so sad to see, but we're here today to try to help the family of the Koenigses to do whatever we can to try to help. Over at Laconia High School, a sidewalk chalk message honors Koenig and Nevin Zock. An obituary saying Zock had a quirky and hilarious sense of humor and lit up every room he was in. A moment of silence and a fundraiser took place before a basketball game at Laconia to honor both Zach and Koenigs. It's been almost overwhelming to see the whole Fond du Lac County community to come together in support of these um, three adolescents who um, have been impacted. Officials at Sully's Irish Pub have also organized a fundraiser, setting up collection boxes for the families of the teenagers at several local bars. Fond du Lac is a really close community, um, and at times of tragedy and loss, everybody does come together, everybody is supporting one another. In Fond du Lac County, Paul Stino, Local 5 News.